Hello and welcome to Maths is Magic. We have been doing arithmetic progression. We will start with exercise number 5.3 from NCRT. Question 11. If the sum of the first n terms of an AP is 4n minus n square, what is the first term? That is S1. And what is the sum of first two terms? What is the second term? Similarly, find the third, the tenth, and the nth term. It is given that Sn is equal to 4n minus n square. We have to find out S1, A, S2, A2, A3, A10, and An also. Sn is equal to n by 2, bracket 2a plus n minus 1 multiplied by d. If we put the value of n as 1, then it is 1 by 2, 2a plus 1 minus 1 multiplied by d. That is 1 by 2, 2a plus 1 minus 1, 0 multiplied by d. Or 1 by 2, 2a plus 0. Finally, 1 by 2 multiplied by 2a. Here 2 cuts 2, so s1 is equal to a. Now we will put the value of Sn as 4n minus n square. Here n is 1, so S1 is equal to 4 multiplied by 1 minus 1 square. That is 4 minus 1 or the value of S1 and A is equal to 3. S2 is equal to 4 multiplied by 2 minus 2 square. That is 8 minus 4 is equal to 4. We know A2 is equal to S2 minus S1. S2 is 4 and S1 is 3. So, A2 is equal to 1. Now, to find out D, A2 minus A1, that is 1 minus 3, is equal to minus 2. An is equal to A plus N minus 1 multiplied by D. Putting the values, 3 plus N minus 1 multiplied by minus 2. Or 3 plus Minus 2 multiplies both the terms, so minus 2n plus 2. So it is 5 minus 2n. So value of an is equal to 5 minus 2n. Now to find out a3, we'll put the value of n is equal to 3. So it will be 5 minus 2 multiplied by 3, that is 5 minus 6, or a3 is equal to minus 1. Similarly, to find out a10, we'll write 5 minus 2 multiplied by 10. That is 5 minus 20 or a10 is equal to minus 15. Thanks for watching this video.